Here at Pattern, we love the ocean. You could say the sea, it calls to me. No. It calls me. I've That's how you have to say it. it. Oh my gosh. I'm it's sorry. Moana's line. Here you go. It's the wind in my sail on the sea, 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 haunting me. One day I will know how far I will go. I mean, my voice sounded almost identical. We are identical pleased to almost. introduce to you Moana herself. We've got actress Ali'i Cravalho. Thank you so much for being with us. We are honored and so appreciative that you're here. And, you know, we're talking climate. We're talking ocean. This is so exciting. You're actually using your voice to inspire us to care for our oceans and our coral reefs. Can you tell us what you're doing? Yes, absolutely. First of all, thanks for that intro. Um, but I have partnered with Kuleana Coral Reefs and the Sheba brand to uh, raise awareness about the surrounding immediate need to protect and preserve coral reefs in Hawaii as well as in the rest of the world. Um, I wanted to share that Sheba Hope Grows program has 30 restoration sites in 10 countries across five continents. And since starting in 2019, coral growth has increased from 2% to 70%. And wow. fish populations have increased by 260%. So it's great work, but also scientists predict that by 2043, 90% of the coral reefs will be unfortunately dead. So I, there is a ticking clock to this and I'm really glad to be partnering with a brand who cares. And I'm also a pet parent. So it feels good to know that mm -hmm. um, the food that my cat is eating also um, has a bigger impact. Wow. So of all the causes that, you know, you can choose, why is it specifically this cause that it really speaks to you and you wanted to get involved with? Yeah, you know, I was born and raised on the big island of, of Hawaii. I have grown up there and I for, have seen firsthand the impact that climate change has had on the environment. Um, that's rising sea levels, ocean acidification that uh, impacts the fish. And then um, with the rising temperatures of our earth, it also leads to major coral bleaching. So I also come from a beautiful family of fishermen. I am Kanaka Maoli, I am native Hawaiian. So I have a lot of issues that are close to my heart, but clean water, whether that be oceans or drinkable by drinkable water, this has always been very important to me. Even, even before the, um, the, the career so, of it all. Yes, of course. <laughs> I just think it's great that it, you know, linked up that way. We're sh we just showed video of like an aerial shot of the coral reef and it spelled out the word hope in it. I see when you're doing this, you can see the change. And so you have that hope uh, of maybe positive change coming in. But we read headlines all the time and it just seems so daunting and that there is no hope. What can people do at home so they can feel that hope and see a change? Yeah, you know, I feel that way. I I'm Gen Z, so I often feel like I'm inheriting this earth that is on fire, but there are simple but impactful ways that you can make a difference. So one, know that coral is a living creature, so touching it or stepping on it can harm or seriously kill it. Also be aware of what you're wearing on your skin when you enter the waters. Um, using a sunscreen that is mineral-based is significantly more reef safe. And then if nothing else, please pick up after yourself. You know, whether it is um, picking up trash at the beach or using reusable water bottles to reduce waste entirely. There truly is always something that you can do to foster a future with more coral and therefore more fish. Well, we love that you're doing this. And I have to selfishly ask, when's Moana 2 coming out? Because we just watched the first one again <laughs> and my kids are anxious. <laughs> oh, you know what? That makes me so happy. As you know, my union SAG is on strike, so I unfortunately can't right. comment about I it. I am really proud to stand in solidarity and I'm glad to be opening the doors for more people and hopefully more sequels because writers should be paid fairly. Right, and honestly, movies like this raise awareness about different parts of the world and coral in general. So that's obviously a big thing as well. We thank you so much for your time. We appreciate uh, you being with us, Ali'i Cravalho, um, and just of course being an advocate for everything that comes with coral reefs since yeah. we were talking about it, especially big time this time of the year, this month. Yeah.